What's up guys? Welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Dutrucci and today we're checking out Ojin's brand new, two day old actually, home isolation video of my favorite TV show and the only TV show that I ever watched in a year, Eurovision. But unfortunately this year it got cancelled due to the coronavirus. But, and I don't know if this is coincidence, but this would have been the weekend that it aired on TV, I'm pretty sure. So we have Ojin, who actually were in it a few years ago, doing a medley of different songs. So I'm excited because I really love Eurovision, uh, especially in the last 12, 13 years or so. I never miss it. And I'm excited to see what songs they have inside this and see if they got some of our favorites from the show. Hopefully new your favorites though. <laughs> but let's check it out. See what they got. Looks like there's a lot of band members this time. Oh, I miss this. Into it. I've been waiting such a long time, looking out for you, but you're not here. Yeah, I love that. What's not a I just knew ABBA would be in it like out of all the older bands that would be in this it had to be ABBA it just had to be it's like the iconic Eurovision band of all time Guys, the, the three guys that are at the very bottom in the center, they're just chilling because there's no trumpets in this song. So they're just like, oh yeah, this is so good. And I guess they're just listening to it 
maybe like if it's home isolation though maybe they can't hear it but they're 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 vibing they're loving it that was like perfectly in tune in harmony with each other like if you weren't watching the screen you would be hard to know that that is three different voices right now i want to i want to see that again we're watching that again socials i already follow your socials <laughs> some of them i don't know if i follow you on twitter though maybe wow that was so good that was so good oh oh it's weird because my a lot of my favorite eurovision songs aren't like the big popular ones it's the underdogs like the ones that usually come like within the top three but they don't quite win because i don't i don't know why but maybe they just don't have that universal touch to them but they're always like the the building up type ones but guys that was fantastic absolutely stunning vocal performance the whole band was there we got the eurovision theme song at the beginning which was awesome i missed that song and it sucks because we don't get to hear it this year. I was so looking forward to it. I want the UK to win Eurovision so that I can go and see it live. That's my number one goal for live, live concerts is to see Eurovision live. And it's going to be like a once in a lifetime thing because the UK always comes like last. We always get like zero points or like 10 points. So the chances of us winning are so slim, but it has to happen. It has to happen. I have to see it live at some point in my lifetime. That's a goal of mine. But wow, that was a great performance. We had so many classic Eurovision songs in there. And the girls sang that absolutely beautifully. Like, it was really hard to tell that that was three different voices at that one part. 
that is incredible because they're not even hearing each other sing like they're all doing their own parts because it's the home isolation version so the only thing they hear like i don't even know if they hear the music <laughs> do they even hear the music i don't know but hey that was awesome but guys let me know what your favorite eurovision song of all time is down in the comments below and i will let you guys know mine in the description I'm not going to give it away on the video. I'm going to give it away in the description. And I'll even link you guys to it. But thank you guys for watching. This is uh, Ojin with the Eurovision medley. Let's see what they come out with next week. I know that they have a live uh, online concert. So I'm sure you guys will have a lot of fun with that. And I will see you guys next time. Peace.